So there we know him as the youngest winner of the 237 Showbiz Music Competition. We have seen him share the stage with Cameroonian football superstar Samuel Etofis. All these are a result of his impressive talent and confidence in delivering his great punchlines. Punchlines and talents which have won him three awards so far and numerous opportunities to perform at events across the country. But what many of us might not be familiar with is Kwan before all the success and his journey to becoming one of the most successful and spoken about artists on that 10 in Cameroon. Kuan comes from the northwest region of Cameroon. He is the second in a family of three boys. Growing up, his brothers and him were big fans of rap music. They loved singing along to Sakodi, Stanley Eno, Ice Prince, and so many other legendary MCs. After some time of letting her boys use her remote control as a mic as they tried to sing along to rappers they saw on TV, Kuan's mother ordered them to go outside and leave her remote control behind. But this doesn't stop this superstar from practicing for a career he envisioned doing someday. To Together with his brother and some friends, they decided to build their studio behind their house. This studio consisted of equipment made up of sticks, foams, ropes, damaged cassettes and keyboards. The limited nature of their studio didn't stop the boys from making working at the studio their favorite after school activity. On a fateful day during their fun slash rehearsal session, Kowan was noticed by a passerby who took him to a professional studio in which for the first time he was given the opportunity to sing on the beat with trained guardian. After a lengthy period of working on his craft and perfecting his skills, in 2018, Kwan signed up as a contestant of the 237 Showbiz Music Competition. His first video during this competition was titled Time to Shine. The video recorded a 47,000 views, far above the second contestant who managed to record an 8,000 views. Kwan once again impressed fans when he introduced the Bottle Vance tune at the semi finals, scoring 18,000 views within a period of seven days, making him the first to qualify for the finals of the 237. Showbiz music competition. Entering and winning the 237 music competition was a great boost for his music career, and since then, his fame and name kept going to greater heights with the release of every music video, an album, the winning of awards, and so much more. All the best, Kuan. Your limit is above the sky. Your presence is criminal opportunities, opportunities which take you closer to your dreams every second. That's it for this week of 237 Before They Were Famous. Make sure to subscribe and hit the notification button. Let us know below who will you like us to profile next. Thanks for watching. Stay blessed. It has not been easy for me, but I'm working very hard to be the best in Africa.